Good morning. Happy Thursday. Happy getting over the hump day. You know what I'm saying? One day closer to the weekend. But y'all, let's get into a little bit of news. So the Philadelphia Eagles, we've been making moves, okay? Okay? We've been making a little moves. So we signed a edge rusher from the Detroit Lions. This guy was a third round pick in the 2020 NFL draft, Julian Okwara. So Julian had 38, he appeared in 38 games. He had four starts, 54 tackles, um, 12 tackles for loss. 16 QB hits and nine sacks over um, his, his 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 young career. I guess you could still say his young career. He also had an interception as well. So, Julian, what's up? Welcome. We'll see if you make it through training camp, if you make it through, um, you know, the preseason games and earn a spot on the roster. Okay. But for anybody saying Julian is just a, just a training camp body, I don't know if he's just a training camp body. I mean, the guy's getting to the quarterback. Um, he's he's not getting in that many games. I don't know if it's due to injuries or depth. We know um, Detroit had a deep pass rush room, at least this season and last season. So 2023, 2024, 2022, 2021 season. They had a deep pass rush room. So obviously probably hard to get on the field there. But it seemed like... When he on the field, it seemed like he making some plays, baby. It seemed like he making a little plays. So, obviously, it's going to be hard for someone like him who doesn't have that much experience. Cracking the Rasta, cracking that 53-man Rasta. But every dog is going to have a chance to show us. Are you a dog or not? So, that's why I don't want to say somebody is just a training camp body. Because let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see what he can actually do and not diminish what he possibly can do. Um, people are saying, just joking, just jokes, y'all. People are saying, oh, Hassan Reddit replacement. Oh, this is why we're not signing Hassan. Yada, yada, yada. Just jokes, just jokes, just jokes. Um, but it is funny that when Hassan is having his contract issues, you know, we go and sign an edge rusher. Somehow, it was like something with waivers and all that because free agency doesn't officially start until three weeks. So we did a whole bunch of jumping through the loops, jumping through the hoops to sign Julian. But it is kind of funny that, you know, this is happening right after his song. We, we, we find a little edge. We find a little edge rusher. Uh, but I'm excited. I like seeing that, you know, the offseason has officially started. We're getting one step closer, one signing closer, one transaction, one move closer to the 2024-2025 birds. But also, since we're talking about contract extensions, Landon Dickerson did say he spoke on the Eagles and his future in Philly, and he said he wants to play in Philly for the rest of his life. He doesn't want to go anywhere else. He wants to have his whole career here. He said his whole career here. His family loves it here. He loves it here. This is home. And we know that Devontae Smith and Landon Dickerson are going to be receiving extensions soon. So it's good to know that, you know, Despite all the drama that we had this season, the drama that, you know, we had last offseason, you know, the fans and the players going at it, and the drama we had this season that, you know, these guys still want to be here. So we got to focus on the good. We have to focus on the good, you guys. So let me know what you think. Make sure you like this video. Leave a comment. Subscribe. Keep rocking with me. Check out the links down below. Buy me the coffee to help fill this channel. Shout out to the Fitness Smallest Business Merch Collection. And until I'll talk to you guys next time.